what's up guys, welcome about the Ralph Tower, as you guys can probably see or at the tracks. And um, well, today is June 5th or 6th, I'll edit it right here. And it is 1.28 in the morning. Um, my mom told me to be home at 12 o'clock. And yeah, you can see how that turned out. But the reason I don't, haven't came home yet is because I am after one train. One train, NS289. Now, the reason why I'm out for so late is because it has an engine on it that, you know what, I'm gonna put my seatbelt on first, hold on. It has the last engine I need for the Heritage Series. It is 8105 Interstate. Now, I really wanna catch this, so that's the reason why I'm out so late. Now, I do hear a westbound, I mean, sorry, eastbound, because I heard some EMD power, so I came over here and checked these signals to see if he already had clearance, and, well, he doesn't, so. Oh, turn. So, I don't know, but it got the Roanoke about two hours ago, so it should be relatively close, if not already in Radford, at least. So, we're over here at CP Wiser, Dublin, but, yeah, we're going to just set out here. I know I'm going to get, uh, you know, yelled at probably by mom because I do have summer school, sadly, for one class. <sighs> so, that's fun. Just like last year. It's always one class that gets me. I pass all my SOLs, but one class gets me. But anyways. Ugh. You gotta pass, you gotta pass. Like I said, I need that diploma in my hand so I can work for NS. Don't care what I have to do to do it, but I'm gonna do it. But anyways, we're gonna check these uh, westbound signals. You know what? We're gonna risk it. We are gonna, oh, that's a hot hole in half. We're gonna risk it for a biscuit. We're gonna go down and see who to Radford and see what will, because we have two distant signals in between CP Wiser behind me and Radford, CP Radford. So we're going to go down to there, and plus I have more light at Radford anyways, I don't know what I was thinking about catching them down here. But yeah, we're going to head down to CP Radford real quick and uh, catch them there. Alright, let's see what this one says. If this one is colored, well, we are um, we are in the bad. Also, what's in the bad is all this fog. Anyway, slow down. Wait, yeah, right here. Are you colored? Are you colored the other way? Okay, we are good. I swear I'm just going to put my head out the window. Abracadabra. Look how much clearer it is. Okay, let's see what these signals say. All red. Yep. Now, let's see what these signals say. If you're wondering the reason why I'm showing you this is so if y'all ever come to Radford, you guys know what to look for. That's a train headlight. That are you a cop? Nope. Okay. Come on. Come on, light. So, this is going to be the most riskiest decision I have ever made. Y'all are about to see what I mean. I'm going to go down to the defect detector. Don't you be turning, don't you? Okay. This is going to be the most riskiest decision I have ever made in my lifetime.
Come on, Ford. Come on. My mom's probably checking my life 360 right now. She's like, what is this kid doing? I am rail fanning. This, I'm going to miss him. I already know. But luckily, I know these back roads. Yeah, I know there's deer. But... And technically, there's no speed limit on a back road, just for y'all to learn. If it's a back road, it does, the speed limit can be 60. If you're wondering where I drive like this, GTA. cars good Jesus, oh, Jesus Christ. 